You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do at this point will not really matter because your skin color has already confessed to the crime. All right. You have the right to an attorney who will try his hardest to see that justice is served, but a jury of your peers, AKA our attorneys, will have him outmatched 12 to one. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided to you free of charge because he is also on our payroll. <laughs> Do you understand these rights as they have been read to you? Whoa, 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 don't move. I see you reaching for your nine millimeter wallet. I see you reaching for your 38 caliber inhaler. Whoa, I said don't move. Stop breathing. You're puffing up your chest. I feel threatened. Stop resisting arrest. Is that a weapon? Lay down. No, 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 face down. No, 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 face ground. Bang, pow, oops, I did it again. I'm a pop star. No, I'm a pop star. No, I'm a cop star. No, by the time I get back to the precinct, I will be a rock star. Clap for him. I have more trophies with black names on them than BET award winners. Clap for him. I will probably be honored at the NYPD award dinner. Clap for him. They are going to throw me a parade. Clap for him. Because when I clap for him, they go to the grave. Black boys' cries fall on deaf white ears. Black mother's tears keep graveyard grass greens. <laughs> black mother's tears keep graveyard grass green. And black men's bones are the gavel with which judges finalize false convictions. Wake up, black boys. It's time to declare war. I wonder if Trayvon Martin's mother, how she feels that her son is a household name and he is not a household body. I wonder if Freddie Gray's family can still say grace over their food even though their prayers could not stop the thief that robbed him of his last breath. I wonder when Tamir Rice died playing cops and robbers if he still saw the former more innocent than the latter. I wonder if black women feel closer to God because they're steady having to lay to rest their only begotten sons, I wonder if black people, I wonder if black people's skin got darker because we're closer to the sun, then how many years will it take us, for, take us to grow bulletproof skin because we're closer to the guns, I wonder. Come on, baby. I wonder if black people's skin got darker because we're closer to the sun. How many years it will take us to grow bulletproof skin because we're closer to the guns? I'm tired. I'm tired of going to funerals where babies are being buried in boxes bigger than the ones they used to put their toys in. I'm tired of not being able to say, see you later to my friends. We're steady practicing our goodbye words to each other. I'm tired of not being able to tell my girlfriend, let's wait until we're married. I'm scared she will walk down the aisle and see me in a box before she sees me in a tuxedo. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired because I'm forced to stay woke in a society whose laws are written as lullabies to black people. I'm tired, I'm tired. I wonder if America will be alarmed when she wakes up and sees black folk ain't sleeping no more because the American dream is the African American nightmare. I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired because I'm forced to stay woke. And if I finally go to sleep, I might stay asleep forever. That's 